this is April and um I just probably woke up about maybe like an hour or two ago and um I'm telling you this because I still look sleepy so just in case you were wondering but anyways um I washed my hair last night and I wrapped it and also um, when I wrapped it, it was wet. I didn't have time to, like, sit under the dryer. It was, like, 12 o'clock in the morning. I like to do stuff late. I don't know why. That's just me. And that's also another reason why my hair looks crazy right now. Right? Okay. So, um, this section right here, I've already, um, flat ironed this straight. And I thought about, I thought about it, um, I'm like, hmm, let me do a video, um, on how I actually flat iron my hair like after I finish wrapping it. Sometimes I don't have to flat iron my hair when I wrap it and then sometimes I do. Like you can tell this side is straight or whatever. I don't need to flat iron it. But the top part tends to get crinkly like if I sleep well. And like I said it was wet. But this is how it looked before it was flat ironed. Okay so if you can see that how the hair is like, maybe I should do it like this. How the hair is like really crinkly, whatever. That's how it looks. And as you can tell, that doesn't blend in together. Okay, so, as you guys know, my flat iron that I always use until I get a new one is my Belson Pro Flat Iron. If you don't know, this is how it looks. Okay. It was $40 at Sally's, but now it is $20 at um Marshall's um and TJ Maxx I'm pretty sure yeah so anywho's um taking a red tail comb and it doesn't have to be in the specific way that I part it I just um you know part it whichever and I take it and I go to the root okay if you guys can even see this okay and I scratch it all the way down, kind of bending it a little bit like that. Because I don't want it too curled at the ends. I just don't. So that's why I did that, okay? Alright? So that's basically how I do my front. And um, it's been like three weeks since my last perm. Okay, so um, my roots are kind of getting thick. I go to the root again like that. Kind of hold the heat there for a little bit on and off. Pushing down and, hold, you know, taking it up. And I go all the way down like this. Kind of bend the flat iron forward a little bit. And there we go. And I don't have anything on my hair right now, by the way. If I didn't already say that, I don't think I did. But yeah, I don't have anything on my hair. I use a bigger, um, a wider flat tooth, I mean, um, a wider red tail comb. Okay. Mommy. Shh. Mommy. Yes, Adrian. I can't get the paper. You're not supposed to be writing in that paper, on that paper. What? You need to get your coloring book. It's in the closet. Okay, these are the smaller sections. In my yes, Aja. Okay. I'm not gonna worry about combing that out right now. Alright, 
So, um, as also I want to say after I show you how I usually, um, also after I show you how I curl my hair, I'm going to also show you how I wrap it. Because after this, I'm going to wrap it up until I go out somewhere. Okay. As you can see, I just took that piece. And I'm also curling it forward over here. Okay. Because I don't want to have a part. I used to do the thing with the part. But today, I just don't want to do it. So that's why I wrap my hair a different way. I do wrap my hair a lot of different ways, okay? So, but today I'm just going to show you how I wrapped it last night. And also when I did that relaxer video on my channel, I wrapped it this way. But like I said, I'm going to show you after I'm finished. I'm going to kind of be um curling my hair in forward motion. Or slanted motion. Where's my clothes? I don't know, baby. You just had them. Okay, so now I need to get my smaller flat iron, which is this one right here. Okay, Okay, I'm gonna do my whole head as far as like the small curling like this and I'm not gonna do my sides right here or my sides uh oh okay or my sides over here okay but I'm gonna continue around my whole head I just showed you how I'm doing it right here so um I'll be back Okay, I am back, and I have did my whole head. Like I said, I wasn't going to do this part right here. Um, here's the back, and this is the whole view of how it looks. Okay, so that is how I curl my hair after um, I flat iron it. Um, I'm sorry, that was backwards. This is how I flat iron my hair after I wash it. Okay, um, like I say, this isn't an everyday thing or every time I wash my hair. I don't do this every time, okay? But um, I do do this on those times where um, my hair tends to get crinkly after um, I wash it and it doesn't lay down right. This is what I do. And I only put heat on my hair like once a week. And that's basically it so when you guys see me putting heat on my hair in um videos don't think it's back to back to back it's pretty much like once a week like when i wash it then i do the little curl styles and stuff but i'm gonna start doing more styles where i um use my pink curls and my um rollers and you know stuff like that just to let you guys know that i do not always use heat on my hair okay